Welcome back to Andrew Jean Cleaning. Today we're doing something a little bit crazy. We are putting these aluminum balls, I just took two sheets here, rolled them up into a little ball here, and putting them in our washing machine. We got some good old Reynolds wrap here, Reynolds wrap here. You know, things that float around the internet, half the time they're garbage, and the other half of the time they're actually good hacks that save you time and resources. So that's what I do up over here. Is I do it for you so that you can decide whether it actually works or not, and it's not just to get video views. So yeah, that's how it goes. So we're throwing these in here. The idea is that this is supposed to help reduce static in your clothes from clumping so that they can wash more effectively. I don't quite understand why you would do this in the washing machine. I 100% understand why you would do it in the dryer and I will talk more about that here after we're done putting them in the washing machine. But let's just see if this actually does anything here in the washing machine. Again, makes no sense why we do this, but apparently this is a craze and this is popular. So we're gonna give it a whirl. So I'm gonna get this run in here. I'll meet you back here. We'll throw it in the dryer. And again, I'll talk about why aluminum can save you a lot of money as opposed to buying dryer sheets, which a lot of people don't like because of the chemicals associated with them. I'll also talk about these wool balls as well, which I love. While that is running here, I'll talk about this super, super quickly. This is acrylic paint. I'm also gonna be doing a video about how to remove this. So stay tuned for that. And we're back. It took me a while to dig these out of the washing machine here, but this is what they look like. So they are a bit more compact. Now I would say if you have delicates in here or things that could easily tear, I would not recommend this because there is a chance it could get caught on here. Um, so I do warn you about that. Next things that we're gonna do here, to use these in your dryer, which I do think is awesome. I'm gonna tell you more about that here rather than using something like Downy. I like both methods, I think they're great. These dryer balls are awesome too. You can put in up to eight dryer balls just depending upon how big of a load that you have. And these dryer balls can last up to like five years. I purchased these at Walmart and I love them. We have, ton, we have a ton of them. Some are probably buried in baskets of laundry that need to get uh, dried. Okay, so the reason this works so well is when your clothes are agitating together, and it does work in the washing machine, but heat, I think, gives it a little extra boost. When clothes are agitating together, they create electrical charge because there's a transfer of electrons between the clothing. So that's where you get static electricity. But what happens is when you have something like Reynolds wrap or aluminum foil in there, the metal attracts the electrons. Therefore, they're not mixed within the clothes and the clothes are not sticking together. So that is the science behind why aluminum foil. So you can use it in your washing machine, but if it's up to me and what I just do is I put them in my dryer, again, with not any sort of delicates or that sort of thing. But this is better than dryer sheets, especially if you don't like perfumes or chemicals, and this is much cheaper, in my opinion, that you do. Let me know if you've tried this before. I would love to hear your experience with them in the comments box below. If you are new here, hit me up on Instagram, Andrew and Co. I teach women how to turn their passions into profits, and this cleaning and organizing channel is one way to do that. Also, check out all the goodies in the description box below. Take care.